In today's video, I'm going to show you guys a tool that you can use to make music videos and it's called Astrofox and Astrofox is a motion graphics tool for creating audio reactive visuals which are synced to music. So with this app, you can combine images and text with audio elements like sound waves and spectrum bars that react to the music that you create. And you can go further by adding one of the many effects that are provided to enhance your visuals and then afterwards you can save your work as high definition and share them on social media sites. So the main goal of Astrofox is to provide you with a tool that lets you quickly and easily create videos of amazing music visualizations. And one of the reasons why you'd want to use this tool is because, for example, if you're a musician, nowadays there are so many videos everywhere and your goal is to have as many people as possible hear your music. So with Astrofox, you can create a catching videos that will play on big social media platforms such as Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. And if you're an artist or a marketer, you can quickly create and easily generate motion graphics without having to hire or pay a designer or developer. So this just goes to show you how easy this app is to use. You can use it, you don't even need any kind of training or anything because the interface is very easy to use. So I'll show you an example. Yeah, so this is the interface of the player. It's very easy to use. All the controls are here on the side. And they're self-explanatory for most of them. And if you're a podcaster, you can easily put together a moving video to share. And also this app can be used by any creative who just loves creating, tweaking stuff and experimenting. So, so I'll show you guys an example of what I've created using this tool in the past few days since I downloaded it. So I'll go to my files, select a project, yeah so this one I made it just today, so I'll let it play and sh show you guys. An example of the kind of things you can do with it. So you can see that the elements that I added to this video, they are synced to the music. So if the music has like hard beats, you can see even the elements are reacting to it. So I have several projects, so I'll show you in a minute just how you can make your own using these tools. Yeah, so to create a new project, you just go up here to File, select New Project, and it brings your plain interface. And so on this app, you create videos using scenes. So when you open this app by default, it has created for you one scene which has the text, the bus spectrum and the image. So you can find the controls on this right side. So up here on the layers, you can see this scene one, it has text, it has the bus spectrum and it has the image. So let me include some text. I can write something like video. Yeah, so you can also change the font. So this by far is my favorite font. You can increase the size. So I'll use a hundred. Yeah, and then you can also change the color of your text. But I'll prefer it remains white. And then this X and Y controls, X is used for moving the elements that are on your video horizontally so you can move it either to the right or to the left and then Y is used for moving your elements vertically so you can move it either up or down rotation is self-explanatory and then opacity it determines how transparent your your element is so if I reduce it the text became becomes less and less visible and if I increase it it becomes more visible so I think I'll reduce my opacity a bit. And then the next thing we look at is the bus spectrum. 
so the bus spectrum is this white thing you see over here so let me load an audio file so that you can see how it behaves let me use summer vibes yeah so the bus spectrum you can change the you can change the color of it using this shadow color you can change the position on the screen so you can just modify it the way you want and then why is this for moving it down or up so I'm just switch it to remain at the center and then rotation just put it the way you want really yeah so I'll increase my height and to become more visible and then for an image you can choose to add an image or just let it be so for mine I won't add any image but I'll come here there's also these controls where you can add a display so I'll use this 3d geometry and then there are different shapes and they are also all of these elements they are synced to the music so if I change the shape maybe to a tetrahedron you can change to that you can also change the material this basic all this so I love normal because it comes with all these different colors so I think I'll do the box and then you can switch in the color of the box if you want the position so you determine it's part of the video you want it to be and then Z is for changing the size and then opacity is for changing the transparency so if you reduce it it almost disappears so I'll increase my size yeah so you can add more displays as many displays as you want and there are also effects so the one I love is the RGB effect this RGB shift so if I start playing the music again and then you can change the offset so it kind of splits the elements you see it splits them by the different colors you can choose the angle and all that yeah so you can just play around with it to it however you want so if you want to add more elements can also create more scenes and all of them will be synced seamlessly with one another and help you come out with a, a very fantastic video so if you want to add another scene I'll choose there then add the elements I want you add the display so I can add a sound wave yeah it looks so good and then I can also add you can add text so I'll write here add and then my name yeah I change the font maybe a 30 yeah and then you can move it to the bottom so it becomes kind of like a watermark so yeah so I can put that the it looks kind of like a watermark and then I can also add another display You can add this wave spectrum, then you can move it to the bottom, 
you can also change the color the width the height and all that so just move it to the bottom here yeah so that's basically how you use it it's very easy to use you can use as many scenes as you want as many displays as you want and whichever video you use and whichever yeah so that's basically how you use it it's very easy and you can find their website that it will be linked in the description below you can go and download the app and start making amazing videos so among other cool features of this app is that it has a built-in video renderer so after you've uploaded your audio file and have selected your visuals and you've done everything that you want to do you simply click save from the file menu so i'll go to my file menu and i'll click on save video and then you choose the location and you want it to be saved so mine when you'll go to the astrofox folder and just save it as video then you save and then you can change all these the format the quality the frames per second and then it starts and you can see at the bottom it starts rendering your video yeah so other cool features about this app is that it is audio reactive which means it performs real-time audio analysis of your music to drive amazing motion graphics. So you can watch as shapes and effects, pulse, rotate and move to the beat of your music as you have seen while I was creating it. So it also has real-time rendering which means that you no longer have to use keyframes, you no longer have to wait for your scenes to render. Everything in Astro Fox is rendered in real-time and you can even add and manipulate effects as the music is playing just as you have seen me do. And also Fox also features a streamlined interface that lets you easily control your visual elements so you can quickly experiment with new ideas and watch them happen live as you are creating them. And then it also lets you compose individual scenes with their own set of displays and effects and you can seamlessly blend the scenes together to create something completely unique. So as you have seen I've created two scenes and all of them have blended in so someone can't even tell them apart. Yeah, so rendering takes quite a bit of time, but I think it depends also on the amount of scenes you have. So Astrofox runs on Windows 7 Plus, Mac OS 10.10 Plus, which is Yosemite or newer, and Linux, so it runs on Ubuntu 12.04, going up, and Fedora 21, Debian 8. So to use this, you'll also need a video card that is capable of running WebGL. So if you don't know what WebGL is, it stands for Web Graphics Library and it's a JavaScript API for rendering interactive 2D and 3D gra graphics within any compatible web browser without the use of plugins. So it is usually integrated in most web browsers like for mine I use Mozilla. It is already integrated with WebGL. Yeah, so the app is free, can be downloaded for Windows, Linux and Mac OS. On you can also use this app to create a video for a loved one. Maybe on their birthdays or their anniversaries, you can just create something special and unique for them using this app. Yeah, so that is all for today. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in the next video.